Hello, my name is Eddie and welcome once again to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to talk about one of the most common topics between our customers and that is what is the difference between the MOPA technology and the Q-Switch technology. Remember that the Q-Switch technology is most known as the fiber laser engraving machine. So let's find the difference. It is a common question from our customers and they wonder what is the main difference between these two technologies. It is only the color engraving over some materials. Why Mopar laser it is more expensive? Which materials can these technologies engrave? These and other questions will finally get an answer in this video. So let's start with the main difference. What's the difference inside? Even if these two machines have a very similar or same outlook, inside they work differently. The fiber laser machines use a technology called Q-switch that allows the power supplies to generate the path light only between 1 to 500 gigahertz. Moreover, the master oscillator power amplifier generates the power source with a different method and this allows the machine has a pulse frequency with more amplitude than the fiber from 1 up to 2200 gigahertz or more this enabled the mopa laser to have different engraving results over some plastics and metal materials in comparison with the q-switch or fiber laser technology so there we arrive to another common question of our customers which materials can these machines engrave this mopa and q-switch or fiber optic laser engraving machine can engrave the same materials gold, aluminium, stainless steel, platinum, silver, titanium, brass, nickel, carbon steel, in general all the metals, IBS plastics, PC plastics, PLA plastics, silicon plastic, PVT plastic and others. The main difference is that MOPA can engrave multiple colors over stainless steel materials and sometimes on titanium. Also, it has a better effect on the plastic material because the MOPA laser engraver has a low rate of melting effect over the plastic surfaces. MOPA is still a technology that is developing. They still have some advantage and disadvantage in comparison to the fiber laser engraving machine. So let's check what is one of those disadvantages that MOPA have. Even though this technology is not new, but it still is far away from the highest speed of the engraving that fiber laser can reach. The color engraving with the actual MOPA laser technology is in fast. And this is something you should expect if you are looking for engraved thousands of metal pieces a day with a colorful logos. On the other hand, the fiber laser or Q-switch machine have a better rate of engraving speed over some plastic and over some metal materials without marking color. In conclusion, both technologies can engrave the same materials. However, if you are looking for have a better result on plastic surfaces and engrave some colors on different materials like in stainless steel, then you can choose the MOPA laser technology. Moreover, if you are looking for engraved metals at higher speed and you don't need to engrave colors on metals, then you can choose the fiber laser. These machines may look the same, but they are different not only on work effect and technology, they are also very different on price. MOPA laser technology is also well known for being more expensive than the normal fiber Q-switch laser. I recommend you visit our page web www.barshlaser.com slash blog. You will find a lot of information related to this technology and related to all the information you need to know before you buy a laser machine. I hope you give thumbs up to this video, subscribe to our channel and keep in contact with us. My name is Eddie and see you next time.